One of the things about my homeland, Ireland, which is a, a welcoming, wonderful, magical, mystical land, it's a land of legends and of leprechauns. <laughs> and one legend has it that at the end of every rainbow, you'll find a leprechaun and a pot of gold. Now, leprechauns are small, fairy-like creatures that bring you good luck, well-being, and happiness. And I remember my granddad said they were only about this size. But leprechauns bring you well-being and happiness. And also, they say that late at night, they say this back in the village, that late at night, if you're very lucky, and, and if you're very quiet, you can sometimes see leprechauns dancing on mushrooms. That's right, not smoking mushrooms. <laughs> dancing on mushrooms. <laughs> Especially when they are happy because they, leprechauns have reached out and helped someone in need. Leprechauns dancing on mushrooms, helping someone in need. Now that's a pretty rosy story. And as you move further and further away from the magic and from the mystery of your childhood, why, it's one you might not even believe. But one thing you can believe though, is that you can bring the colors of the rainbow you can bring the magic of the leprechaun and you can bring the spirit of that Irish legend into your heart and into the heart of others when you reach out and help someone you know who is going through tough times today. The gift of gab, goals, attitudes, behavior. If you had a goal to reach out and help someone in need today, and I would bet that everyone here in this room knows someone today who is struggling. That's the world that we're living in. But if you were to reach out and help someone, you could make a difference to that person. And when you reach out and help so that person, you may well actually sow a seed. And that next person may reach out and help someone else. And the next person may reach out and help someone else. And the next person may reach out and help someone else. Every one of us here has been someone else at some stage.